Hey, what's going on YouTube? It's Outdoor Guy 365 coming at you with another great video. So today we have uh, what I picked up, well this is a little while ago anyways, uh, the Husky 7-piece hook and pick set. And uh, what I did is I went to Home Depot during their Black Friday promotions and specials when they had a whole bunch of stuff really cheap and I picked up this pick set. They have really, really teeny tiny guys. They have the curved one like so. They have the angled one that's at, I don't know, 135 degrees. They've got the 90 degree. They've got the curved one. Then they've got the straight, really long, sharp one that's really small. Then they have the larger ones like this, this, and then the big curved one like there. Uh, I bought these because I just got tired of the hassle of sending stuff back and forth between Matco, Mac, Cornwell, Snap-on, all those guys. But what most people don't realize is Husky is owned by Stanley Black & Decker, which also owns Mac Tools. So I think this purchase for uh, $9.97 in Home Depot's Black Friday deal was a pretty good bet. And I'm going to try these out today because I'm working on the snowblower over there because my shear pins broke and I need at least this pick to make sure that the hole doesn't move on the auger where I'm replacing the shear pins at. But that's a different story and it will be a different video. They do offer the lifetime warranty on this set. Uh, as it says, it's made ideal for removing and replacing O-rings, cotter pins, springs, and other small items. I figure, okay, if I put one of these through the auger box and make it a placeholder for my shear pin until I was able to get the pin in there, that I don't think is going to be too bad. So, how many of you guys use these Husky uh, pick tools or just this pick tool set? Or maybe you have a different type of Husky tool. I was looking at the 290-piece mechanic tool set that they had on Black Friday deals uh, for $99 because you really can't beat that. And again, like I said, the tools are under the same company as Stanley Black & Decker and dewalt along with mac tools so i don't think it like i said i don't think it's a bad buy nine dollars and 97 cents makes them less than it makes them a dollar and like change dollar and 18 cents or something like that per item in here yeah sometimes you get what you pay for but in this instance i think it's a really good deal Home Depot wouldn't sell a lot of tools and be in business if they sold crappy things. So, anyways, let me know what you guys think about the Husky Pick and Hook tool set. It's uh, going to be hopefully used for a while by me. I, I Like I said, I got tired of sending the stuff into Home Depot. and or Not home, sending it into Home Depot. I, I can walk into Home Depot with one of these and get it replaced right there on the spot. Same day, no problem, no questions asked. That's their policy. So I said, okay, I'll pick these up. Lifetime warranty. Uh, and as they state, if your Husky tool, Husky hand tool ever fails, bring it back and we'll replace it free. This full warranty gives you specific rights. You may also have other rights which vary from state to state. So yeah, they say, okay, where the safety glasses made in Taiwan. I, I try to buy American. I try, I try. These used to all be American made. Um, this is what is in there. That's the product number, just in case you're looking for it. And it does also come in Spanish. So they got the Comfort Grip handles, I thought, for ten, for less than 10 bucks, Definitely worth a buy. I picked these up at Home Depot in Three Rivers, Michigan, because I live in Chicago, and the sales tax is about 4% difference. So I try to pick stuff up while I'm over there versus here. So anyways, let me know what you guys think. Do you guys use these? How do you like them? I'll uh, use it myself and I'll do a follow-up video 
uh, for you guys uh, after I've used these for a while. So anyways, uh, talk to you later, guys. This has been Outdoor Guy 365 and uh, I think these are going to be a really great addition to my tools here that I have, and uh, I look forward to doing more videos. All right, guys, talk to you later. This has been Outdoor Guy 365 with another great video for you. Bye-bye.